You're so cute. Look at you. Look at you. Okay. I know it's been a while since we've uploaded a video, but um, if you guys have seen the last video that I posted, um, the documentary video of saying goodbye, you'll know exactly uh, why I haven't been around. Thank you to everyone who has watched that video and commented and um, you know gave me their feedback and their condolences. Uh, I'm really excited to be back on here. I got a new puppy and I'm really excited to introduce you guys to her. She is a My Possum Frenchie. I did breed her. Um, right now she's 14 weeks old. Um, her name is Keefley and you guys are probably wondering what that means. And Keefley means uh, essentially it's a Hungarian like baguette. Um, it looks like a croissant, but it's not. It's got the density of a baguette. So that's the simplest way for me to um, essentially describe what Kifli means. And I felt that, you know, given I'm Hungarian, Fuli's Hungarian, he's got a Hungarian name, that it just made sense that we give her something traditional as well. Today's video is going to be about what it's been like for me and my experience having another dog, another Frenchie living with us and how she has been blending into our lives and into my home uh, with me and Fuli and uh, basically the challenges that we've had. So we're gonna go over all the pros and cons and hopefully it's gonna help you guys to decide whether or not you guys wanna add another Frenchie into your lives. So um, I guess we're just gonna roll right into it. Now, right now, as I'm making this video, Kifui is about 14 weeks old. And one of the challenges that I'm facing right now is time, especially when it comes to me leaving the house for a couple of hours to run some errands. I have to make sure that Kifui has had her bathroom breaks. I have to put her into her crate, make sure she's comfortable. And sometimes we'll even do a little training session before I actually leave, just so it exhausts her mentally and physically. So when I do leave, I know that she's gonna be in her crate and she's gonna be relaxed and she's most likely gonna be sleeping. Now having a second dog has been great, but it also means that my expenses has increased as well. So I'm paying two times the amount of food, supplements, insurance, our vet visits have increased as well for annual checkups. And I also have to account for, you know, unexpected visits to the vet in case, you know, something happened with Fuli or Keefley. I have to take that into account as well. Also, I live in Canada where it's very cold. It's minus 15 right now. So I have to get two times the amount of clothes for both dogs. So when it comes to food, I'm very lucky in the sense that both dogs are eating the same proteins and I haven't had a need to change anything for Keefley um, or experiment with different proteins if she had an allergy or anything like that. So the only thing that's really changed in food requirements is that we're buying more of it because there's two mouths to feed. Now the last thing is that both dogs require different kinds of attention. Being that Kifli is 14 weeks old, she's still young and she's still learning. I'm spending a lot of time with her, training her and holding her just so I can build that trust and that bond with her. But at the same time, I still need to make sure that I'm giving enough attention to Fuli and giving him his alone time with me, just so he understands that he's still a part of this family. Our relationship remains the same before we had a second dog in the house and just so he doesn't feel left out as well. But also it's been really nice to have a friend for Fuli. So if I do need to go out or I'm busy during the day, they can preoccupy each other and he's no longer left alone. So I promise you there are some benefits to having two dogs. It's been really great and the benefits are is that I get to experience a whole puppy phase all over again. So all the mistakes that I made as a dog owner with Fuli, I get to not do with Keefley. So it's actually made training a lot easier having a second dog because I've learned so much over the years, but also I have Fuli as a good guidance. So he's actually training Keefley at the same time while he's helping me as well. Keefley absolutely adores Fuli. The first thing that she does in the morning when she gets let out of her crate is that she bolts over to Fuli 
and just jumps on him, kisses him, and licks him. And it's just the sweetest thing to witness. And I'm really happy about that to see that the two dogs are getting along. Not only has Philippe benefited with having Kipli around, but I've benefited as well. Uh, just because I do have a young puppy right now that is really relying on me for guidance, this has made me have more structure in my life and to get up earlier, to get things done because there's a lot of things that need to be done uh, in the morning before I start my day. Not only that, but I am also getting two times the amount of love. Whenever I come home and they haven't seen me for a few hours, they both run towards me super excited and it's just really nice to come home to that. If I'm watching TV, then I always have one of them near me or on me. Keith Lee generally likes to curl up next to me where Fuli likes to just kind of hang out by my feet. But regardless where they are, it's just still really nice to be able to enjoy life with these two amazing Frenchies that I have now. Also, I'm never left alone. It doesn't matter if I'm going to the washroom or going to my bedroom or leaving the kitchen. I always have one of the dogs following me in or out of the room. So with having more structure in my life, it's also making me create a routine for Gifli as well that fits in with our lifestyle. So she's got a good routine for her food, her walks, her bathroom breaks, her training and her playtime. Now over the years I've learned a lot of different new methods and new techniques for training. So all of those things that I've learned over the years, now I could start applying them with Gifli as she's a puppy. And I gotta say, it's been a lot easier to train Gifli than it has Fuli because I wasn't as educated back then as I am today. All in all guys, it's been great having another puppy. Um, yes, it's been more expensive month to month. Uh, there's a lot less time, but the trade-off is that I do get the double amounts of love. Fuli has a companion to play with now. And we're back on this channel making videos. So I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. You guys know what to do. And we'll see you guys in the next one. Have a good one.